Hello and welcome to Poseidon Tech. In today's episode, Ajax Hub Plus. So, stay tuned. Hub Plus comes in this white box. So, let's unbox it. Inside the box you will find the quick start guide, a power supply cable and an ethernet cable, and of course the Hub Plus main unit. It looks the same as normal Hub. Let's remove the mounting bracket. Inside you will find the installation kit. On the back you will find the socket for the power supply cable and for the ethernet cable. Two slots for micro SIM, QR code and the on off button. Let's see now the differences between Ajax hubs. From Ajax official website go to products and select hub plus. Scroll down and click on compare. So, according to this list, Hub Plus can support 150 devices, 50 cameras and DVRs, 5 range extenders, which is amazing. By the way, please watch my tutorial about Ajax range extender. It supports 99 users, 25 partitions, 64 scenarios, Unfortunately, it doesn't support visual alarm verification with motion cam detector. Hub Plus also supports 2G and 3G cellular networks, Wi-Fi, and of course Ethernet. Back to Hub Plus. Connect the power supply cable into the power supply socket. and the Ethernet cable from LAN port of your router or switch into the Ethernet socket. Press the power button to turn on the hub. The hub is now loading. After a while the Ajax logo LED will become green, indicating that hub is ready. Before I continue with the programming, I suggest you to watch first my step-by-step -step tutorial for Ajax Smart Alarm. It will definitely help you if you are new to Ajax products. Open Ajax Pro app and tap the add icon. Give a name for your hub. Tap on QR code to scan Hub Plus. Tap OK. Go to Devices. Tap on Gear button. Go to Wi-Fi. Connect Hub Plus to your Wi-Fi network. Now you don't need any more the Ethernet cable. So you can remove it. 
Now from settings, select cellular. I will disable cellular data since I don't have any SIM card installed for now. Select also Ethernet. I will disable it since Hub Plus is connected to my Wi-Fi. Now let's add the room and the device for testing. I will add Ajax Leaks Protect. Except the mobile app, you can use also the Ajax Pro Desktop, which is for Windows and Mac OS. I will download it for Mac OS. Open the DMG file. Drag the Ajax Pro app to the application folder. Login with your Ajax Pro account. Here is the Ajax dashboard. Now, according to Ajax, Ajax detectors operate at distances up to 2000 meters from the hub in open space. So, let's test it. First, I will tape the leak protector on my Mavic Pro. Then I will move Ajax Hub outside of home. Now let's take off. The goal is to fly the drone away for about 2000 meters and test the signal strength of the Ajax Leaks Protect. So far so good, 3 bar signal strength. One thousand five hundred meters and still three bars. Now signal is lost. Of course this is not accurate since the polling period between hub and sensor is about 12 seconds. But still it's amazing. Look at this distance. Now let's return Mavic back and check again the signal strength. I will stop here for a couple of seconds to give more time to hub. As you can see now, we are 40 meters above the ground. Whoa, one bar! Let's continue. I will make another stop and wait for a couple of seconds. Yes, three bar signal. Of course, testing the signal on the back of a drone is definitely not normal, but from the results I believe that the specs are telling the truth. 2000 meters is possible. Thank you so much for watching. If you like my tutorials, consider subscribing to my channel. See you in the next episode.